The main thing holding us back right now is just to uh, conquer Venezia from these guys. So we've got two separate wars at least. Uh, these guys are actually guaranteed by Milan, which is like best case scenario. We can head over here and uh, steamroll through these guys. I probably wouldn't even co-belligerent them because it's just two provinces. Uh, so we're going to do that. Obviously, we have to wrap up our war over here first with um, Portugal. So I'm just going to get these guys over here eventually. And uh, all we need to do is siege this stuff down. All I want in this war is uh, this stuff down here. Um, we'll come back for this stuff later on. There is no major pressing issue. But welcome back, everybody, to uh, to Byzantium. I hope you guys are enjoying the run. I certainly am. Had some uh, comments about some constructive criticisms about um, rap, uh, using my uh, having my, um, what was it, a couple of episodes ago. I pieced out and my uh, end screen was showing over the end of the text. Apologies, I didn't do it on purpose. Sometimes it just happens. I try to make sure that I'm not doing anything um, important towards the end there. But um, I got this one. It was quite literally, it was a wall of text. Um, so I understand what you want. I, I get it. I will say I don't think it's that big of a deal. But um, I, you're, you're, uh, it is noted. It is definitely noted. I want to make sure that I'm not, you know, shorten you guys on content, right? If, if there's an important thing, I'm going to try to make sure I get it on camera. Of course, they take Evora, like, super quickly. Very annoying. It is what it is. We'll be able to embrace manufacturers before too long. I actually didn't even know it spawned, so that's funny. Uh, let's give this over to uh, to uh, those dudes. Scorch that province. Barrage this down. Give it to them as well. Oh, hey, hey. How's it going, dudes? You guys doing all right? Yep. Sounds good to me. Let's make sure we get our general in there. Our 4-4 general. Absolutely. We lose. Dude, I'm so sick of this game. <laughs> I'm so sick of it. Fuck you. I mean, screw you. Whatever, dude. <laughs> I really, really hope that uh, combat is fixed in these coming updates. I cannot do it. My, my, my heart be still my beating heart. All right, we are overextended. That's okay. Yep. Oh, immediately lose the stability within a quarter of a second. There you go. All right. We're just going to speed five it through a couple of these guys here. And, um, yeah, sounds good. So, Age of Absolutism, we've got most of this done. We just need to let our Absolutism tick up a bit more. I can yoink a couple of these guys. It's not really a big deal. Yeah, we don't need that. We don't need that. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Georgia's a subject. Well, I can subjugate Georgia. They'll probably accept it. Yeah, heck yeah, bro. <laughs> Look at that. So let's see. They may actually even be a better. So mountains, Georgian traditions. What do you guys have by default? Defensive mentality is March. So they would actually get an extra five over here. Plus they're both red, which is hilarious. Do they have defensive ideas? They're, yeah, they do. Nice. Cool. You guys will make a great subject. Really? He's 69? Oh, wait. What did I... Oh, it was from the event. I was going to say, we have the, uh, the whatchamacallit, the thing. You know, the thing. Um, let's see here. Let's switch on over to a Diplo Focus. A little more even. He's going to die soon anyways, but it is all good. Moroccan Separatist, you'll have that. Let's have you guys suppressed. Let's have you guys suppressed, of course. Let's go ahead and uh, make sure we are improving relations with them. We want to subjugate them ASAP. We can uh, influence them, of course. There's a couple of things you can do. You can influence. Once I get an extra diplomat, let's uh, recall you. That will give you a 25 plus a little bit of trust. You can offer them military access, which gives them another 10. You can send them a small gift of 1 million ducats. And that will get you another 25. Okay, these guys want 50 ducats. They're greedy. That's fine with me. And then we also need to... You can have them transfer trade power to you, which will give you a little bit more. We'll give you another 10. And uh, we can also scornfully insult... Um, who is this? Tabriz has migrated. Tabriz has migrated all the way up here. Send a scornful insult to one of their rivals. And there you go. Now we can uh, offer them vassalization. And that will allow us to have those guys be nice and happy with us. Um, sure, I'll take the mana. No problem. I want to take tech. We can embrace institution whenever we feel like it. 
Uh-huh. We are still ahead of time enough on tech that I'm not going to take tech super far ahead of time. Do a little bit of extra development. We want to get up to 60 development or 60, uh, what's it called? Crown land as soon as possible. That is fine with me. As soon as we embrace this institution, we're still only three years ahead of time. So we'll be able to take all these on time. No problem at all. Um, yeah, just going to need a little bit extra money, but this is fine. So let's see here. AE is, we're definitely going to get a coalition up here. There's nothing we can do. I'm not going to co-belligerent Milan because um, they'll call in a bunch of people. So instead of doing that, we'll just take it as a non-co-belligerent. It'll be a little more expensive, but I, I don't think it'll be a huge problem for us, honestly. Let's have our general over here. They're not even there. Oh, they almost didn't uh, didn't defend themselves here. There you go. It's blockaded. Let's get a four siege general over here. You just need to siege down some forts. Get over. Oh, my. bro. What is up with these AI and stacking up like 100 million men on a province? All right, let's um, let's take this over ASAP. There you go. That way they can't get across even if they wanted to. Because this is a lot of men right here. Jeez, oh, Pete. All of... How... 60,000 men. That's crazy. That's a lot of men. <laughs> that is a lot of men. All right, cool. It's fine. It's not a big deal. I'll make it work. Now I'm just uh, coring up everything and converting everything I can as well. Important country. Eh, we don't need it. Yeah, we don't need it. Just stab up. No need. I think it's unnecessary. Let's have you guys come on up here as well. Yeah, let's uh, use our ships to get this army over here. Get a full army on here. Oh, our poor, our, my poor subjects. It's all right. We will win these sieges ASAP. And it is a holy war, so if I'm going to fight battles, I need to make sure I'm winning them. And I will give this over. See, look at this. Albania gets 95. Georgia is only 70. Oh, shoot, because I didn't march them. Derp. <laughs> That's okay. I'll have to march them first. No problem. I can do that easily enough. We sunk the Milanese flagship. You guys suck, and I hate you. Get bent mate, as the Brits would say. All right, very good. So these guys are over here. Uh, this is a minus one for them. They might reinforce. Oh, they definitely are. Dude, I am I am like kind of in awe at how willing the AI is to just stack up. Oh, they're really going to freaking come for me as well. Dude, they can kiss my balls, man. I'm so over it. I'm so over it. The AI is so annoying with the dogpiling, man. That's just how it goes. That's just that's how Mafia goes, you know? All right. So these guys are over here. This is fine. Now that their armies are at least kind of split, I can make something happen here. Sorry, I get a little annoyed here. They and 70,000 men! Force marching. Bro, I'm over it. I'm so over it. I'm over it. <laughs> I'm so over it. Oh my goodness. Okay. What in the world? Okay. If they want to sit on my fort, they can, I suppose. Put it on defensiveness. State it. Defensiveness probably have a bunch more states on defensiveness that I don't need to be paying for. So let's take off a few of them. Yeah, I'll we'll keep that one on there over here. Don't need this one here. Yep, this is fine. So these two, look at those. Decent defensiveness. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, obviously, we need this money here. So we can do this. I reckon I could uh, do a little bit of this, that there. Like this button here. And uh, take all three of those techs right on the yearly tick. If there's no innovativeness to be gained, I don't particularly care. A little bit of improved relations is for the best, in my opinion. All right. So what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going <sighs> to... Fort Zone of Control is so annoying. All right. Let's have you guys come over here. Here you go. Have these guys come on over here. These guys come on over here. Of course. They're going to dogpile me. I am so annoyed. All right. Let's see here. Let's go with a discipline guy, of course.
Am I going to lose here? Yep. <laughs> Whatever. How come one army fled and the other army didn't? I don't know, man. At this point, I'm I'm just honestly convinced that the AI is just like, uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Don't forget, though, if you guys want uh, twice daily uploads, we're getting a little close. Uh, this, the, the previous episode was uh, right on the very edge uh, where we almost didn't have the double upload today. We will. We will. Well, at least I think we will. I don't know. I'll have to find out. If you don't see a second episode in a couple of hours, then that's why. But I do appreciate the support so far. You guys have been incredible. All right. They, I bet they had. Yeah. Yeah. That's my fault. They had a Militech advantage on me for tactics. That explains a lot. Okay. Well, on the bright side, that means I am good now. I should be able to uh, steamroll them. Let's see. Do we have the icon of St. Michael? If not, we're going to get it. There you go. Ooh, hold on a minute. There you go. Make sure we get that all the way up as high as possible. Once we get up to 90, we'll get even more. But this doesn't matter because we've got all the ones we needed. But uh, more absolutism is just good in general. Uh, let's go ahead and boost that up as well. And then uh, let's switch on over to St. Michael. Uh-huh. Monarchist, definitely. A 443 is decent. He's still a Palaya Logos. Very good. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Let's have you guys recruit a general. You guys do not want this smoke. I promise you, you don't want this smoke. I promise you, you do not want this smoke. I will keep reinforcing. There you go. How does it feel to lose, you know, half your population of your entire country at one time because you guys are being dumb? It's not worth, not worth it. I promise you. Look at this, dude. There's so many of them. I'm just in awe. I am absolutely in awe. It's all good, though. We've won the war at this point. It does not matter anymore. Um, Half-off trader going away. He's not even the appropriate culture, so it's fine. Um, let's go with the improved relations. We're going to need that. It's going to help out with uh, reducing our aggressive expansion once we uh, peace out. It's going to be a little painful. Let's have you guys come on over here with our general. Get those rebels off of my fort. If they want to sit on my fort, they can, I suppose. Uh, uh, matter of fact, I would like to separate piece you guys and just take those two provinces. 42 AE. This game is so broken. Oh, it's so much development, man. Uh, <laughs> that is so painful. Well, we have to do it. If we want to progress through our mission tree, we have to get this. So once we get this, these provinces, so we'll be able to take all five of them in this mission, in this war. Uh, that will give us some bonuses. And we will sack and destroy Venice, apparently, which is good. You know, revenge for the Fourth Crusade and all that. Uh, and then we already have the Eternal City, so that will give us National Unrest and AE Impact. <laughs> Very nice, uh, which will allow us to, for 15 years, we get 5% AE Impact. Okay. <laughs> and now we get claims on basically all of Central Italy, which we've got most of it. We can also restore the Pentarchy, which will give us missionary strength and tolerance to the true faith for the rest of the game. And we get an event, the Pentarchy. Rome reclaimed as well, which will give us, you guessed it, more patriarch authority. It's almost, you guys seeing the trend here? <laughs> uh, but we will also get a more missionary strength for 10% missionary strength versus heretics, which is crazy. For how long? 20 years. Man, a lot of these missions have extremely weak rewards. Like, uh, well, you'll get, you know, plus a half a prestige per year for six months. You know, it's like some of them, some of them are great. Don't get me wrong. Uh, let's give that to Albania, give it to Albania, give it to Albania. They can have all the forts. We're doing Fortress Milan over here. We'll carpet siege them down because Milan is the overwhelming majority of this. Somehow, Venice has 20-some thousand men in the field or 30-some thousand. I don't know how, but they've got it. Uh, this is fine. We will piece you out for this as well as all your money. That is fine. Nice long truce is appropriate. And um, you guys over here... Let's have you guys over here and you guys over here. You guys down here. No need to suffer anymore. Ferrara wants out so I can just white piece them. That's fine. I probably should have converted them. I understand I missed opportunity there. All right. So these guys will get stack wiped then. I might not even need to. Let's see here. They will accept peace. Coalition will form. Oh, no. Anyways, 
We will now yoink this development. 25 development will go down, which is nice. We'll core it all up as well as full cores up here, I suppose. Uh-huh. Let's turn off this edicts because we don't need to pay for that. We will now click Annihilate Venice, giving us some morale, manpower recovery. That's useful. And the sack and destruction of Venice will gain some money. And we will devastate Venice. We will gain some mill mana as well. Always appreciated. Um, does it say Venice will gain 40 mill mana? Let's see. We have 150, 154. So let's see how that goes. Anyways, we will also get uh, local unrest, but it will cost more to dev it. And uh, autonomy change will go down. And then Constantinople will get dev cost. Okay. We did gain the mill mana, so that's good. We also get the Eternal City, which will give us National Unrest, AE Impact, and then some claims. Very good. We will also now get Restore the Pentarchy, giving us Papal or Patriarch Authority. Oh, shoot. I should have switched over to this one. That is a mistake on my end. Oh, well. Well, it's fine. We'll, we live and we learn. The Pentarchy, the wound is healed. We gain, disables the Papacy mechanic. Okay. And, um... We gain uh, prestige and stuff. That's fine. And then Rome reclaimed, giving us more patriarch authority. Yearly legitimacy and missionary strength versus heretic. So since I just conquered all that, rather than coring it, I should probably convert it first. So let's go back here. Recall all you guys, because we can convert it extremely quickly. Three months each. Pretty good. Pretty dang good. All right, so let's have you guys over here, you guys over here, you guys like down here. We're probably going to get a coalition. There's not really much I can do here. I am going to go ahead and designate these guys as a march, of course, and I will give them officers. Pay off your debts as well as you. You guys are useful. Burgundy will join my coalition. That's all right. I don't actually care about this. Scandinavia is formed. I'm going to go ahead and ally Muscovy. Um, They're not super strong, but the Commonwealth is strong, and what that does is basically it makes it so we're a lot less likely to get attacked. The coalition is going to form. There's nothing I can do about it. At this point, it is just going to happen. Um, it's okay. It's all right. Um, see, these guys here have a truce until 66, and we will attack them as soon as our truce is up because we're going we're gonna to have to start annexing lots of people over here. So, like, Luca, we need to attack them. All right, they join my coalition. Pisa is not in a coalition. They would call in my ally. Yeah, Pisa is about to join my coalition as well, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, they left our coalition, really. Austria joined, but Burgundy left. Switzerland has joined. I mean, if it fires, it, it can fire. I, I don't care. What are they going to do, you know? I will win, because you just turtle. You just build a couple of forts. Like, once we get this stuff up here converted, like, we've got level 6 forts on our border, right? These are all level 6 forts. Let's let's build, um, let's build a level 6 fort here. That will be better than this one here. And it will still communicate with the, the Celestria one. Let's upgrade the one at Theodoro. Upgrade that one here. Right. We need to build one here. So these all communicate now. So we have some pretty sound borders. Let's build another one over here. Fine. Perfect. Sure, take the Diplomana. I love having Diplomana. You know what? Rather than Dev, we're going to change it up a bit. We're going to boost up our Mercantilism a bunch. Look at that. More trade power now. Now let's see here. We still only have 26. Granted, it's 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 uh it would be higher. I don't once we take Tuscany, I think is when we will start really considering. Hmm. Yeah, these guys don't have any cores or anything like that, so it really wouldn't make a lot of sense. Yeah, we'll attack Milan and we'll be able to take all of this. We have a nice long truce with a bunch of people, so we've got uh, we've got some time, got some options. Just let our stuff tick down a bit. Oh, these guys. Good thing you left my coalition. Oh, Burgundy's a junior partner of Milan. Um, well, that would explain why they left my coalition. Am I right? <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. All right. All is well, though. All is well. Let's suppress you guys. Since we converted it all, look at that. Even with uh, 30 years of separatism, our tolerance is 12. Minus 10 unrest. Isn't that kind of nuts? That's pretty good. That is pretty dang good. Now, the reason why I'm not trade companying this stuff over here, even though I could, is uh, because it, it's an end node, but we're going to steer as much trade from here over to here as we can. So we may be able to collect over here if we wanted to, but it's not necessarily like super beneficial. 
Let's see here. Oh, Alhambra. Right, we need to upgrade Alhambra. I forgot about Alhambra. Admin efficiency. Yes, it must be done. We must upgrade Alhambra. We also need to upgrade this guy. Reward score cost versus other religions. So we've got lots of uh, lots of money we need to be we need to be stacking up here. I'm making good money. It's not the best um not the best um percentage ever. We are blessed. Free money, eh? I'll never say no to free money. I will happily take that. Thank you. So France is at war over here with a bunch of people. Is it they're contesting, I assume? Are they losing it as well? They are losing it. All right. So I'm going to attack Pope Man and annex him literally the instant I'm able to. Come with exiles? Yeah, sure. Free mana? I mean, I would be a fool to say no. All right, so does this give us 0.25 for level 2? No, it's just the final one does. This is fine. I'm spending my manpower. It's fine. And then the top tier is... Um, the Diplo rep is fine, but it's that 5% um, admin efficiency is what you really want. Liberty of Desire and Subjects is nice. I mean, we don't have any subjects that I need to worry about with that, but... Let's see. Liguria. All right. We probably could make this happen. Because we can, like, upgrade the, this to a level 3. This guy definitely needs to be a level 2. Level 2 over here. Let's upgrade you to a level 3 eventually. Yeah, there's a lot of trade power over here. I don't know, man. I kind of want to get Tuscany before I start um, considering switching over. I just think it's for the best. Royal marriage with Great Britain is over, so let's go ahead and royal marry him. We should probably improve our relations a bit as well. Make sure that they are... Um, Feeling a bit better about it. They have great trust with us, so that is fine. Um, France has a disputed succession. Let's go ahead and see De Lorraine, huh? It'd be really nice to get a PU on them. Um, support the Cossacks, I suppose. Hmm... All right, we're going to get plus... Oh, we already have plus five. Right. So this one here gives it max absolutism. This is fine. Let's just boost up our... Uh, spend it on that. Make sure our governing capacity is uh, not holding us back. All is well. We're still well ahead of time on all these. So let's go ahead and develop a bit. What that will do is this will allow us to get a bit more crown land. And with that crown land, we if we go over 60, we get plus an plus additional. And so then if we get rid of this here, which that will make them mad, but who really cares? Honestly, not me. Yes, 40 trade power in Ligurian Sea. Fine by me. That puts us up over 100 now. So we can now max it out. And so people were asking if we were going to do court and country. That's why you don't need to. They changed some stuff in Emperor. Makes it kind of un unnecessary. Not kind of. It makes it un entirely unnecessary. So let's build these guys up, of course. I want to make sure we are building as many trade upgrades as humanly possible. Make sure we are um, maximizing our trade power. Lose a stability for no reason whatsoever other than a random event. It happens. It does. It happens. It, it, it you know, it is what it is. As annoying as it is. <laughs> so our religious unity is affecting that. Let's see here. It's Georgia Orthodox. Do I have the click? I click over here. They are very good. It's fine, Chad. It's fine. All right. Very good. We just need as much trade power as possible. We definitely need to get more trade power down here in Alexandria. Because there's tons of steering that we can get done. People are leaving our coalition because uh, they know that they can't hang. They know. They understand that. They're like, you know, it might be a giant mistake <laughs> if we were to do this. Um, let's go ahead and delete the church here and then upgrade this or build this trade center here. Rather, Portugal is probably interested in joining a coalition, but I also don't care about that either. Two base. Per hey, heck yeah. Thank you. Yeah, we got a couple of things over here. 
Let's get rid of this fort here. Build you. Tripoli. Need to um, develop you a bit. So let's develop you and then we'll build this one as well. Basically, we just want to make sure we have as much trade power as possible because there's still quite a bit of trade that is being steered into here. You know, obviously, if we can stop that trade from being steered out, we want to. So let's upgrade you. Upgrade you. Well, it's too low of a... All right, Tripoli. We want to build that there. The more trade power we have, the more we steer up into here. As soon as we take this merchant out, it will go over 40. So it's kind of funny. We're kind of like a gaming that thing. And then I need to just get these guys here. If we could steer from here, my goodness gracious. You know what? <laughs> I think I would just might do that. Oh yeah, just just doing that upgraded the um look at this. Just doing that, it turns from 13 to 15. <laughs> Alright, I lied. This is all converted. Oh what? Oh, I forgot! I totally forgot! There's an event! There's an event that fires. A bunch of people embraced it because we oh I totally forgot about the event where Catholic countries can become Orthodox. Look at this. We have Orthodox Scandinavia, bro. No way. No way. That is awesome. I totally forgot about that. I totally forgot. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that's awesome. I totally forgot about that. All right, cool. Well, that is going to do it for today. If you guys are interested in some more, make sure you leave a like. 500 likes. As long as we're getting them, we will continue the twice daily uploads. Uh, assuming we did today. I'm recording this the day before, so I don't actually know if we will. But uh, if you are interested, show some more likes or show some support. Leave a like. If you want to join the Discord, subreddit, Twitter, those are all linked in the description. Subreddit's been popping with this series. You guys seem to be appreciating it. And I appreciate all the good memes of me uh, screwing up and uh, being a sensitive crybaby. <laughs> Uh, I appreciate you guys. If you want to uh, support me on my Patreon, you get early access to Tubert vids. Links in the description below the video. That's all I got for you for today. This is Jewish Shoot, and I will catch you guys later.